doing a quick update. All right, so it appears that a lot of people have been released who were arrested earlier today. Um, however, some of those people have not received their phones or their recording devices back. Um, they were kept as evidence uh, by Leon Valley. So they were arresting witnesses and they confiscated their cell phones and their cameras. And Leon Valley has no respect for the First Amendment there. They don't care if you're a witness, they're going to arrest you because we're just going to do what the chief says. They don't care. They're blindly following the chief. This sounds like the Nazis all over again. We're just following orders. This is ridiculous. They're not even standing up to, uh, f standing up on a, standing up for the law. They're not standing up for these citizens that, uh, that they're violating. They don't care. We're just following orders. And that does sound very, very familiar. Okay? Now, of those witnesses and people that were arrested was a man that was handcuffed and placed on the ground and he passed out due to heat exhaustion and it took paramedics over 20 minutes to get there and take him to the hospital but the EMS is right down the street the fire department is right down the street from the police department I mean you can literally walk down the street and get there it just makes my blood boil that these people have the audacity to treat citizens like this they're supposed to serve and protect. But, you know, we're, everybody's starting to get the notion now that that is not true. They're only serving and, serving and protecting themselves. That is exactly what's going on right now. So, as I said before, a lot of people who were witnesses were arrested and released and had their cell phones and their cameras confiscated. It didn't matter if you were pressed. They will confiscate your cameras, too. And that's exactly what happened out there for Pinnack News. Um, also, I do not believe it's a good idea to go back out to Leon Valley because they have no respect for the First Amendment. It is very dangerous to go back there and to continue protesting because they're going to find a way to arrest you and to retaliate against you. As of right now, there are so many civil rights violations stacked up against the city, it's ridiculous. And I can tell you right now, the lawyers are all involved right now. And I can tell you two words, class action, class action. This lawsuit is going to be biblical. It's going to be unbelievable. Also, there's surrounding law enforcement agencies that are watching this right now who are flabbergasted. They are shocked at some of the stuff that is going on in Leon Valley. And that speaks volume. Right now, we are waiting for the Texas Rangers to get involved and to step in and investigate Leon Valley right now. Because I guarantee you that they're in bed with Bannis Towing Company. And, they're in, in, and also, I forgot to mention, they towed everybody's vehicle that was in that parking lot who had permission from the owner to park there. So whether if you're a witness or not, if you were arrested, some of those cars got towed. And it's, it's, it's ridiculous. So as of right now, um, the only three people that we know that are still in custody is Bao, James Freeman... And uh, ethics instead. And they're being charged with resisting arrest. Originally, they were they were arrested for uh, uh, live streaming, and the comments that were coming in on the live stream um, came off as threats. And a chief didn't like that, and he arrested everybody on under retaliation. However, it looks like people are being charged with resisting arrest, but they weren't. But they weren't told they were being on arrest. But you know. It's, it's just ridiculous. Leon Valley has no respect for the First Amendment, and it's obvious. So I don't think it's a good idea to go back there. Uh, we've, it's, it's like beating a dead horse. They're not going to change their ways. We already have the violations stacked up, and we're going we're gonna to let the lawyers do what they do best. And we're also going to engage the Texas Rangers so they can do an investigation into Leon Valley because this is getting ridiculous. Like always, guys, I will keep you updated on, uh, on 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 things that I get. As soon as I get it, guys, I'm gonna update you. I'm ju I'm just really irritated right now with everything that's going on. I, I, it's unbelievable, but that these guys will continue to act like this. But we're gonna change that. So, guys, until then, um, I will keep you guys updated as soon as I receive those uh, those updates from everyone. Um, you guys stay safe, stay tuned, uh, stay vigilant. And Batosai out.